everybody, it's Emily the Crazy Worm Lady. I'm here today with the experimental sand versus eggshell bins. Uh, wanted to take a good look at them today, see what's going on. So this is our sand uh, bin over here and our eggshell here on the right. So I noticed when I opened the eggshell bin in particular, for some reason it was a lot more moist and I do see a few mites running along the other one. But um, anyway, just thought I would note that. But let's start over here with the sand bin. And I wanted to see if we had any worms in the bedding. And I'm not really seeing any. And the moisture feels really good in here. It's nice and flaky. And uh, I'm assuming all of our worms are hanging out in the back here where we fed the apple so pull this here the worms are all underneath which is what I would expect because this isn't really breaking down much although I do see there's a hole in the side, but they primarily have not made it in here just yet. But the good news is that we have worms all throughout the area. Still have some bedding over here. So I'm gonna bury this back up. I'm kind of doubting we're gonna feed in here today. So I'm just gonna mound it up in the corner and just spread it around the rest of the bin. I'm not seeing any immediate signs of cocoons, but that does not mean that they're not here. But at kind of this quick glance, I'm not, not seeing much. So let's take a look over here. This is the eggshell bin. Do the same thing, let's just search here, see if we have any worms. Not really. Not seeing cocoons. Again, that does not mean they're not here. <laughs> Just um, probably a little bit harder to find. So let's get to the business. Same deal over here, not a whole lot going on with the apple just yet, but I'm hoping that we have worms down here. And surely enough, we do. I think they're underneath catching all the juices, all the good stuff. Guy looks like he's ready to lay a cocoon. but still plenty of bedding. And again, in here it feels fine. It's odd to me that there's so much condensation built up. So I'm gonna do the same thing over here, bury it back up real well. Mark it. I'm gonna turn off the camera for a minute, see if I can find any cocoons. And um, then we might just add a little bit of dry bedding today and skip a feeding. But let me take a look and I'll let you guys know if anything cool comes up. So there's one cocoon. This one is here in the um, eggshell bin. All right, so I didn't find anything else exciting. So um, I'm actually gonna sprinkle some sand. This is about half of my scoop here in here. And I'm gonna do the same with the eggshell bin. And I'm just going to add some bedding here. Not a lot, but just a nice handful to each bin to help soak up some of the extra moisture being let off by these um, apples. So two handfuls, that's about even. And 
and uh, I'm just gonna lay these loose newspaper coverings over the side here. I'm not gonna mess with it at all beyond this. I'm just gonna spread this out as an absorbent factor and pop these lids back on after I leave them off for about 24 hours to let the sides dry out. So that's gonna be the update for today. Quick one, guys, um, but all seems to be going well. We did see a cocoon here in the eggshell bin. So we'll give it another week. So let me know what you think. Drop those comments below. Like this video. Subscribe if you'd like some more content from me. And I'll be back with you guys real soon for an update.